Now I'll explain what you have to do before you start up our Bauer Junior. The first thing to do as soon as you receive the system is to check it for any damage caused in transit. If you find any damage, please contact your contractual partner immediately. First I'll take you through the main components of the Junior 2. This is the drive motor, which is a 230 volt AC motor. Here is the actual three-stage compressor with the first stage in the center, the intake filter, the second and the third stages here. The fan guard protects the V-belt drive. Next to it is the air treatment system with the B timer, a device that displays the saturation level of the cartridge, the service intervals and operating hours. This is the automated condensate drain system, an optional feature that automatically drains condensate at 15 minute intervals instead of standard manual draining. When you set up the system, ensure it's on solid flat ground, not gravel or dusty ground. It's advisable to set it up on a solid base. The maximum tilt angle is plus or minus 5 degrees. Before you start operating the system, please read the operating instructions thoroughly. You can consult the instructions at any time for information about the process as a whole. Use the dipstick to check whether the system has enough oil. It works just like a car dipstick. Simply take it out again, it shows minimum and maximum markings. First wipe the dipstick, then insert it fully into the oil tank, withdraw it and check the oil level, which should be between min and max. If there is no oil in the system yet, please ensure you fill the system only with original oils recommended by Bauer. To be on the safe side, check whether the intake filter is already installed. To do this, open this knurled screw and take off the cap. This is what the air filter looks like. If it's clean, go ahead and start the system. Of course, the filter in a brand new system will always be clean, but this is a procedure you need to follow after the compressor has been in operation for some time. Replace the filter, replace the cap and tighten the knurl screw until it's finger tight. The junior is supplied with a tool for opening the filler housing. I'll show you how to fit the air treatment cartridge into the triplex filter. You can open the filter housing by hand. If the cap is too tight, use this tool to help remove the filter head. Now I've opened the filter housing. Here's the filter housing head with safety valve and main o-ring which is located here. Here's another o-ring at the top, but it's not a seal. It prevents metal on metal contact when you tighten the cap and makes the housing easier to open. Bauer Kompressor and filters are packaged like this. As the system operator you should only use original cartridges. Don't forget that your life and the lives of others depends on it. The standard models of these cartridges are filled with two materials. One is a molecular sieve for drying and the other is active charcoal that removes oils and odors. 
die Gerüche und die Öle entfernt. Optional gibt es As an optional extra, a Hopcolite cartridge must be used if the Junior is powered by a petrol engine. Die Patronen sind eingepackt in Cartridges are supplied in vacuum plastic packaging. Here is a chart that enables you to calculate cartridge life if you do not have a B-timer. For example, you can take out the cartridge and weigh it. This cartridge has a saturated weight of 205 gram and should be replaced. You can also calculate cartridge life by using this chart plus the bottle size and ambient temperature. Before you insert the cartridge, lubricate the O-rings with Vaseline or other suitable grease approved for use with breathing air. Then drop the cartridge into the triplex housing until it rests in the housing and press lightly down until you hear it snap into place. Dass man ein einrastendes Geräusch hört. Danach wird der Behälter wieder Please note that the cartridge is inserted the other way around in the PE100 from the Poseidon edition. Before you close the housing again, check that the O-ring is lightly greased and the thread is free from dirt. Als erstes können Sie den Behälter handfest anziehen. Sollte zum Schluss die Handkraft nicht mehr ausreichen, first tighten the cap until it's finger tight. If you can't close it any further, use the delivered tool to close the cap completely. But don't tighten it too much. The cap should sit lightly on the holder. You do not need to close the cartridge housing cap tightly. Die Filterstandzeit wird in this system, cartridge life is monitored by a B-timer. To activate the display, press Enter and the device will show the cartridge status. Enter und Sie sehen dann den Status der Patrone. Im Detail können Sie... The operating instructions have more information on the individual menus. Kontrollieren Sie bitte auch das Sicherheitsventil. Check the safety valve as well. This has a lifting screw device which must always be turned to operation. Turn the screw anti-clockwise to the final position and tighten it to ensure it cannot open during operation. In dieser Einstellung sollte dieses Handrad festgezogen werden, damit es nicht selbstständig locker wird. Vermeiden Sie auch bitte Do not use this safety valve to bleed the triplex filter housing. Ventil zu entlüften. Dazu, wenn das der Feind Use the air bleeder to release pressure in the housing. Verwenden Sie bitte diese Entlüftungsschraube. Überprüfen Sie bitte den elektrischen Anschluss. Now check the electrics. This compressor is operated by a 230 volt AC motor, which should be fitted with a 16 amp slow blow fuse or an automatic fuse. Other drive types available are three phase AC or petrol motor. K-Automaten. Alternative uh, Antriebe wären If a petrol motor is used, it must never be operated in enclosed spaces and must be additionally fitted with a telescopic intake and hopcolite cartridge. Darf dieser niemals in geschlossenen Räumen betrieben werden. Um eine Atemluftflasche zu füllen. To fill a breathing air bottle, I have to use a filling adapter. In this case, a 300 bar adapter. We'll fill this bottle to 300 bar. 300 bar. Zur Wiederholung nochmal. Once again, the red adapter is for 300 bar and the black one is for 200 bar. 200 bar. Ich nehme also dieses Füllventil, setze es an die Flasche. I place the filling valve on the bottle. This is a standard G5/8 inch thread. I turn it until it stops and tighten until it's finger tight. Achten Sie bitte drauf, dass zum Befüllen Please note that for filling, the filling adapter is screwed on anti-clockwise. When you start off the compressor, remember to allow around 30 seconds for the manometer to show the pressure, because the treatment system must be pressurized before the underlying 
pressure maintaining valve opens. Das dauert, wie schon gesagt, so circa 30 Sekunden. Wenn Sie dann hier eine Druckanzeige auf dem Manometer When the manometer shows a rise in pressure, allow the pressure to increase to around 150 bar before you open the valve and begin filling. Ventil öffnen und damit die Flaschenfüllung beginnt. Der Kompressor beginnt dann zu füllen. Once the desired operating pressure is reached, in this case that's 300 bar, one of the two pressure switches will switch off the system, at least in the version with automatic condensate drain system. If your system has only one safety valve instead of two pressure switches, please switch off the system manually when it reaches around 10% below the nominal pressure, around 300 bar in this case, and don't allow the pressure to rise to the maximum. Des Einstelldruckes in dem Fall wären es ca. 300 bar, sollten Sie die Anlage von Hand Ausschalten. Bitte das Sicherheitsventil Please don't misuse the safety valve as a pressure switch. Wenn der Flaschendruck erreicht ist, schließen Sie als erstes When the bottle pressure is reached, first close the bottle valve. Then depressurize the filling connector by turning the filler valve clockwise until you hear a faint hissing sound. This tells you the filling connector is depressurized and can be disassembled. Place it back in the housing immediately to avoid contamination with dirt. Sollten Sie mit dem Füllvorgang fertig sein und Sie brauchen die Anlage nicht mehr entspannen. When you've completed the filling process and no longer need the system, depressurize the filling hoses so that they can be connected to the machine in a depressurized state. The filter housing must always be pressurized, even when the machine is not in operation. Unter Druck stehen bleiben sollen. Nur wenn die Anlage gestartet wird, the exception is when you start up the machine. In this case, release the pressure using the air bleeder valve to allow the pistons to start more easily. Otherwise, the startup power may be too high, especially with AC motors. So release the pressure when you start up the compressor, but always leave the filter housing pressurized while the system is idle. You only need to depressurize the system when you change the cartridge.